Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. How do you know if you have to do taxes? Determining whether you need to file a federal tax return involves several factors, primarily your income and filing status. Income considerations. Your taxable income includes earnings from your job as well as other sources such as retirement and disability benefits, self-employment income, and income from investments or rental properties. Filing thresholds. The IRS provides filing threshold charts that outline the minimum gross income amounts that require you to file a tax return based on your age and filing status. For example, if you have over $400 in net earnings from self-employment, you generally need to file a tax return. Filing status. Your filing status, such as single, married filing jointly, married filing separately, head of household, or qualifying widower, also plays a crucial role in determining whether you need to file. Other reasons to file. Even if your income is below the threshold, you may still want to file a tax return to claim a refundable tax credit or to get a tax refund. This could be the case if taxes were withheld from your income or if you qualify for credits like the Earned Income Tax Credit, EITC. IRS Tools and Resources The IRS offers an online interview tool and a filing threshold chart to help you determine if you need to file a tax return. These tools can guide you based on your specific situation. Tax Documents you will typically receive tax documents from your employers and other income sources by January or February of each year. These documents, such as Form W-2 for employment income and Form 1099 NEC for freelance or contract work, are essential for preparing your tax return. Deadlines and extensions. The usual due date for filing your federal tax return is April 15th. If you need more time, you can file for an extension, which gives you an additional six months to submit your return. However, if you owe taxes, you must pay your tax liability by the original due date to avoid penalties and interest. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.